We got one more, and this is what I consider kind of my classic slime. And all right, I will use that. And I got to tell you, these chemicals you really can't get. Uh, you have to go online to find these. But there's um, there's two. There's uh, one called polyvinyl alcohol. Yeah. That is used in sponges and things. And then our borax, the same borax that we used in this one. But before we do that, a quick explanation. There yeah. is science in slime. Uh, slimes are mostly polymers. And so I'll explain how polymers work here with my messy hands. Uh, if you think of water, each water molecule is separate. So if we go to pick up water, there's a reason you can't grab a handful of water. Because all these little molecules, like these beads, will slip between your fingers. But in a polymer, the, the molecules are all in chains. So when you go to pick them up, they're all chained together. And then our borax and other things just kind of link these chains. It's called a cross-linker, so that you get that nice, gooey, slimy feeling. All right, so let's make some more. Last batch here. This uses uh, polyvinyl alcohol. So we're going to put all this in there. There we go. And this is a liquid polymer, but it's not slimy yet. We're going to make it slimy. Uh, let's make a nice big batch there. All right, and to this, we're going to add 50 milliliters of our borax solution. There we go. And let's get a nice spoon. All right. Go ahead. Stir it up. OK. It looks like jello. Looks like jello. Oh, my god! You don't want to eat this. Just stir it up good there. Oh, my gosh. There we go. Oh, that's some good slime. Oh. All right. <laughs> oh, I know our viewers want to know what this is like. Go on. Reach in there. OK. Take that out. Oh, oh that's some god. high quality slime it. right there. Oh, jeez. Oh. All right, give me that. That's my, that's my, my good lab coat there. <laughs> All right, so uh, we will have the instructions for our first two uh, uh, kinds of slime on the website, and they can certainly go in and check it out. Okay, and the website is www.sciencebob.com, oh, and good. we'll be right back.